clean up dirty water? Well, it's not with soap. You need a filter. And a filter removes impurities like dirt from the water. The filter that we're going to make here today with the help of an adult is going to be like a super strainer and it's going to hold back the dirt and let only the water pass through. The things you're going to need for this activity are uh, a coffee filter, a pair of scissors, a tray, so it could be some water that spills over, um, a little funnel, and a long uh, container to catch the cleaned out water. Let's get started. So as you can see, we're going to take our coffee filter and take our scissors. Um, kids, you might need some help from an adult to help make the cut, but just put a cut down the uh, towards the middle of the filter and just try to fit it in, fit that into our funnel. All right. So as you can see, it's all set. This will act as our super strainer. This is what we call water filtration. This is what many people have to do, um, in a sense, it's a very easy way to show you, very simple way of cleaning up dirty water, which happens a lot around the world. We're very fortunate here in Canada to have very clean water to drink. We have water filtration, but um, here we go. Let's see what happens. I'm just going to tip it a little bit, and I'm gonna show the dirty water going in. So I poured my dirty water and if you can see, you can, maybe we can get a little zoom in shot of what's happening. So as you can see, all that dirt that was in this glass of water here is being held back in this strainer by this coffee filter. And what's coming out is fairly clean water. It's held back almost all of the dirt. I can even pour more into it. Okay, so the water is almost gone through the filter and if we can get a zoom in shot from the camera person and we could show them how clean the water was. This is what we had to start with. We had rocks and we had some dirt, and although I don't think the rocks really quite made it in. A rock wouldn't really pass through a filter. And maybe camera person, if you could just have a little look inside the filter and we could show everybody what that filter held back. So look at all the dirt that didn't pass through the filter. So that is our experiment on water filtration. I hope you try it at home.